a day that many look forward to is now a month long event here to talk about how IHOP's National Pancake Day has turned into a month of free short stacks and the cause it's in support of is Children's Miracle Network Program Director Robin Woodward. Robin, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. So walk me through the change that we're seeing this year from from one day to uh, a month long event. Yes, like you mentioned, it's normally happens on one day and we usually raise between 10 and $12,000 in that day. And those funds are so vital to the work that we're doing at the hospital. So I'll talk about that in a minute. But now we are able to do pancake day for an entire month this year. And the way that it works is our viewers need to go to um, register for myhop on ihop.com or the ihop app for your um, mobile devices. Okay, now you touched on it a little bit there, the cause. Tell me where this money that will be raised is going towards. So every single dollar raised will stay local 100%. So the, the wonderful thing is that we're helping local kids get the care that they need. Kids, may, maybe babies that are born early, like a baby that would wear this tiny diaper that's a pound or, or less. And, you know, we're, we're helping anything from a premature baby to a child that maybe has a broken leg. And we're making sure that people's children, their grandchildren, nieces and nephews, whatever it may be, that they have access to the care that they need right here in Kern County at Bakersfield Memorial Hospital. You know, the pandemic has impacted so many things this past year. Um, you know, is the need greater uh, for donations this year? Absolutely. Like you mentioned, the pandemic has had a tremendous impact in our fundraising efforts. And so more than ever, we need the community to come together and help us. So these are pancakes with a purpose. And so you can enjoy your free short stack and you can donate while you're there in the month of April when you redeem your IOU that you get from registering on MyHop. Or you can donate now. Maybe you don't love pancakes as much as I do. So you can just donate by texting IHOP to to 51555. That's a good point. Not everyone loves pancakes. I must say though, looking at this video, we're showing video of people eating in, in, in an IHOP. They look incredible. Um, now talk to me a little bit about, you know, we touched on the fact that it's changed from a day to a month, but, but we didn't really get to the reason why the, the change came about. So IHOP's main concern is the safety of their guests as well as their staff. And so um, rather than cramming a bunch of people into one place in one day, because we literally get thousands of people that come out in droves in Kern County to enjoy pancakes on one day. And so they decided it would be safer for everyone to extend it where you could get your IOU by registering for MyHop on IHOP.com or the app. And you can literally read redeem your IOU anytime during the month of April. So that way we keep the crowds down and things like that for everyone's safety. Yeah, that's so key uh, at this point in time. Was there ever any doubt, you know, obviously here in Kern County, we just recently moved into a tier where restaurants are able to open with limited capacity. Was there ever any concern that, you know, this event maybe was going to have to be pushed back? Honestly, yes. I thought that we were going to have to postpone until the fall. And so um, fortunately, the stars are aligning, so to speak, so that we can still move forward. We would have been able to do, you know, takeout and they still will do takeout if you um, don't feel comfortable coming in to dine in the restaurant. So just keep that in mind that you can do takeout. Um, but that's probably what we would have done if we weren't postponing it. We would have just done takeout. Well, fortunately, you guys can move forward with the event. Such a great cause. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Again, thank you for having me and allowing me to share a little piece of what it is that we do at the hospital to help local children.